Welcome to Real Channel Automotive, a place to help you understand the world of automotive mobility. Please subscribe our channel for more updates. The Toyota BZ3 officially debuts as the second model in the brand's new family of electric models. This four-door EV launches first for the Chinese market and comes from a collaboration with BYD and FAW Toyota. The BZ3 retains the chiseled nose and upward-sweeping light signature from the BZ4X. Toyota describes this as taking inspiration from a hammerhead shark and being a styling cue for all models in the BZ family. The sedan features a flowing roofline that contrasts with the heavily creased rear fenders. The body's drag coefficient is a sleek 0.218. Toyota hasn't revealed the size of the battery pack, whether different size batteries will be available or how much power the BZ3 makes, but it does say the sedan will be capable of over 373 miles on a single charge. There's also no mention of charging speeds, but one interesting piece of information is Toyota's claim that the battery will still have a 90% capacity after 10 years. Anyone know if these BYD guys do smartphones? Dimensionally, the BZ3 comes up predictably close to its Tesla rival, but is fractionally larger in every metric. It measures 186 inch from bumper to bumper, stands 58 inches tall and rides on a 113.4 inches wheelbase. As for the enjoyable part, Toyota says the BZ3 has been developed based on the family lounge concept, an idea that cars provide a space to enjoy time with family and friends, rather than merely being a means of transportation. The automaker says the BZ3 offers a coherent and comfortable interior space and enhanced digital features perfectly integrated inside the cabin to suit customer preferences. Inside, the BZ3 has what Toyota calls a digital island infotainment layout. A tall, portrait-oriented infotainment display dominated the center stack. It handles the HVAC stereo and even the trunk release. A dial on the console controls the drive setting. The driver looks at a low-profile digital instrument cluster. The driver observes a distantly situated digital instrument display under the windshield by peering over it rather than through the steering wheel. Toyota's announcement of the BZ3 doesn't outline the model's powertrain specs. According to earlier info from China's Ministry of Industry and Information Technology, there would be 178 and 238 horsepower options. The top speed is limited to 100 miles per hour. Toyota says the EV has been designed specifically for the Chinese market and makes no mention of North American or international sales. To be fair, neither does it rule the possibility out, but even if Toyota had originally been considering U.S. sales, recent changes to the tax credit system probably nix those plans. Only North American-built cars qualify for EV credits, meaning it would be hard for the BZ3 to compete on price with the Tesla Model 3 in the U.S. Toyota is working on a whole family of BZ models. According to the company's plans, at least six electric models riding on the ETNGA platform are on the way. The initial strategy is to introduce a compact car, medium crossover, medium sedan, medium minivan, medium and large SUV. These are all the details Toyota is willing to share so far, along with the fact the BZ3 will be produced by FAEW Toyota and sold through the joint ventures dealer network in China. We don't get a launch timeline, but a recent report from Reuters mentioned a production and sales debut before the end of this year, as well as an estimated base price of around $28,000. Thanks for watching. If you like this video, make sure to subscribe for more.